Hello everybody, this is Matador from FreeTradingVideos.com. It is still Thursday, July 30th, 2009. need to talk to you about the trend. <laughs> so you see the nice run up this morning in the broad markets right to approximately the $100 mark. It's a great test in the 99.80 area of that. If I remove this data, so again, just getting rid of the pre and post market data here, you can see this unfilled gap That'll be fantastic support in this area right through here. Uh, some good support down through this area as well. Got a complete gap fill. And we're again, we're selling off just gently after a really nice significant run up. Higher swing low, higher swing high. You can see the momentum shifting here. And then we kind of sold off a bit. And we're doing that now. So back to the 99 support area. And what I want to show you though, of course, after going through some time frames, <laughs> is a breakout like this, like I had mentioned, this unfilled gap powerful, You're starting to see a little bit of a pullback. If it holds up right here and creates a higher swing low, it's a little 15 minute chart in the S&P 500 ETF, uh, we may get another consolidation underneath 100. However, it's really, really hard to smack in the face of this. And so the trend, at the same time all this is happening, I'll go to a smaller time frame so we can visualize that better. Uh, is now at 2.07. So the whole time the markets were running up, it was down here, doing pretty well, and then boom. So right at uh, 11.01 Eastern Standard Time, 11.01 was right through here. See that big sell-off, that big red bar? It didn't look like much, but that was corroborated dramatically with the trend reading. And that's twice as much volume now flowing into stocks that are going down than going up. The trend Q, although not quite as bearish as at 1.4, was at 1.50 now. Look at that little blip up. So you know, that would be 0.75 on the bullish side, 1.5 on the negative side to the downside bearish, right? So again, be very, 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 very careful now how you approach the markets to the long, uh, having that, even though they're holding up, price-wise, and the bank, let's take, check that out, it's also confirming what the broad markets are doing, and then the, uh, we'll check out the VIX, and it has also been rising the whole time the markets have been uh, sort of holding up. A little bit of a sell-off now in the VIX, at the same time the markets have been selling off, and that's actually a positive thing, there's a divergence there, and that, that would shore up the idea that the markets are doing what they should be doing. So again, be very careful with the trend. The VIX is a little bit of an outlier now, and there's a little bit of a uh, consolidation going on, so some mixed signals to say the least. On daily chart though, this nice upper shadow is the unsustainable high we made this morning, that run up to the $100 mark area, and uh, we already knew it was there. So just, again, be very careful how you go long or short right now. Pretty awesome trading action. Very cool. Well. D7 and I were on the phone all morning, <laughs> so uh, we're talking back and forth, and uh, it's great working with everybody in here. Look forward to his video at the close, and uh, any questions or comments, just let me know, and we'll try to answer them. Uh, so take care, everybody.